All right, here's the ingredients that you will need to make homemade fly spray. Number one, I'm starting with a gallon and it's filled about three quarters of the way with water. We will fill it up later. You'll need two funnels, one for the gallon size and one for smaller. Measuring cup. Now I am going to use both a sponge type applicator and I'm also going to use a spray bottle for this. Now let's look at our active ingredients. We are going to use a permethrin concentrate. You can also use pyrethrin. This recipe I'm using citronella essential oil and we're going to mix it with a carrier oil which is a grapeseed oil. You can use fractionated coconut oil or the oil of your choice as well. Now whenever you have a uh, an oil, you're going to have to use something to cut the oil. So we're going to use a combination of apple cider vinegar because that also keeps flies away and gives a good scent. And some Irish spring. We're just going to use a little handheld grater here to put some Irish spring soap in there. You can use just Dawn um, dish soap if you want to, but remember we're creating a suspension so you want to break up the oil so you're going to have to use some kind of detergent to do so. Okay, the main active ingredient is going to be permethrin. Now you're going to get one of these little bottles and you can get these, uh, Farnum makes a good product and they're just a fly spray concentrate and you just squeeze and fill that up to the half ounce and you're ready to grade the Irish Spring. We're going to grade about an eighth, so down to about right here and just have it on your measuring cup. So your Irish Spring or your soap graded, you can just pour it on in and uh, that funnel is going to help you get that in there. There you go. All the way in. Now you can see it kind of float around in there. That's You're going to have to shake that up to get that to, you know, dissipate. Quarter cup, apple cider vinegar. The apple cider vinegar kind of helps out the skin, kind of gets rid of that chemi chemically smell from the pyrethrin. So we'll put that in there. My funnels are awesome. There you go. And your concentrate, you've already squeezed it, so it's up there. All you gotta do is dump it down the funnel now. And you're ready to go. Essential oil. You need a carrier oil. We put about um, 100 metric milliliters in there, um, about an eighth of a cup and our citronella can be measured out. Each cap is a teaspoon, so we do two teaspoons of citronella. And eh, try not to spill. Always kind of hard to do. There we go, and two tables, two teaspoons of citronella. There you go. Now, once you have your oil mixed, again, right down on in there. The gallon isn't quite full, so we might as well see the oil right there. It's making a suspension. Because we've got oil and vinegar, it's going to break those up. And we are going to go ahead and fill that the whole, almost the whole way up. We need to have room at the top to give it a good shake to mix all those ingredients. You do have to keep mixing this stuff. Remember, it is a suspension. That means it's oil and it's vinegar, so you have to break it up as much as possible. But uh, it fills real easy into a nice little squirt bottle. Shake before you use it. There you go. All right, so there you go. Once you have your fly spray, I highly recommend that you uh, <laughs> definitely label it. And you can get approximately... Four of these spray containers with one gallon, or you can just refill some of your old ones. So there you go. Thank, Thank you so much for joining me on today's video. And if you enjoyed the video, give us a like. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. And remember to see more, check out our playlists.